School safety organizations are hitting the road to keep kids safe on the road. They kicked off National Child Passenger Safety Week today. 13's Lane Gillespie met with them to hear what steps you can take. Lane? Well, Melissa, Child Safety Passenger Week is held every year, aiming to make sure you know how to properly install a car seat for your child or know how to get some help. It's a message they hope clicks. Safe Kids Kansas, the Kansas Motor Carriers Association, Kansas Highway Patrol, and Kansas Department of Transportation met at Gage Park Monday morning to spread the word on keeping your kids safe in the car. Sherry Sage from Safe Kids Kansas says it's vital to know what car seat to use. You know, motor vehicle crashes are one of the leading causes of death of, of children in Kansas and uh, across the nation. So it's really important to know what type of uh, car seat is appropriate for your child when they can graduate to a booster seat, when they should graduate to a, a, a vehicle seat belt. Children's sizes do vary, but the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration recommends that a child be in a backward facing car seat for at least their first one to three years. They then graduate to a forward facing car seat, changing to a booster seat between the ages of four and seven, and finally to seat belt only sometime between the ages of eight to 12, but still in the back seat. A lot of people don't understand that it's actually the safest place to put your child is in the rear seat seating positions of the vehicle. Um, so you should wait until your child is age 13 before they ride in the front with you. The NHTSA says 46% of car seats are misused or not installed properly. The Kansas Highway Patrol can help. We have child safety technicians all across the state that are willing and ready to help you install your, your child seats. Um, these are located in every, in every area of the state. Each KHP regional headquarters is a child seat fitting station and all you have to do is call and make an appointment and the local public resource officers who are also instructors that help to certify new technicians, they're willing and ready to help you make sure that your seats are safe for your children. And the Kansas Department of Transportation wanted to highlight how important it is to use your seatbelt. Robin Meinholt with KDOT told me that more than 97% of kids buckle up when their parents do. We have all these tips and more on our website. Melissa. The little ones are watching your example. Thanks, Lane. 13